While the time for county leaders to vote on a budget involving Hamilton County Schools winds down, conversations are heating up. Well, now the discussion is about increasing counselors in schools. Channel 3's Casey Freeman has more for us. Currently, for every 700 students in Hamilton County, there's only one counselor. After several focus groups with the community, Superintendent Dr. Brian Johnson wants to move closer to the national average. Unfortunately, that still may not be enough. After talking with students, parents, and faculty, the need for more support staff is clear. Superintendent Dr. Brian Johnson proposed a budget that would provide one counselor for every 500 students. That's roughly an additional 25 counselors. So we're not even at the national average. This just gets us a little bit closer to so that we can support students across this county. Counselor Johanna Woods Moden agrees our students need someone to talk to. The children she sees may suffer from anxiety, depression, or have suicidal thoughts. And not performing well in school, not sleeping, um, having issues with their activities of daily living. Moten says some of the warning signs are not performing well, not sleeping, and having other issues with getting involved. Johnson says he wants to invest in bringing out the best in every student. Uh, this is a children-based budget. This budget is about the future of Hamilton County. Unfortunately, this budget does not solve all of Hamilton County Schools' problem, but Moten acknowledges it's a start. In her professional opinion, if we could get down to about 50 students to one counselor, that would be ideal. Working with them in a manner that's uh, appropriate for them, where they will respond and will be able to um, discuss various things in a comfortable manner. County leaders are expected to vote on the budget next week. If the school system does not get the additional funds, they will not be able to hire more counselors. In the studio, I'm Casey Freeman, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.